So tell me where you're from. I'm from Maine. So tell us your story real quick. Um, I had come out here a year ago because I had severe jaw pain, headaches, yeah. uh, my neck hurt, and just my muscles were terribly tight all from my temples all the way down through my jaw. And, uh, and I came out here and I had the mad treatment and yeah. after we screened you. Yeah, after all the, the screening right. process and everything. Yeah, MRI, CT, the neuroclusion stuff. Yep. And I had a, a huge amount of uh, huge amount of relief. Uh, not it wasn't completely gone, mm -hmm. but and then I was a little bit dismayed right after I went through a period of a, about a month or five or six weeks where uh, it seemed like it didn't work. And uh, I was, I thought maybe for a little bit, I thought it didn't work. Yeah. And then uh, it started to get better and better and better. It just took a little bit of time. And uh, now I'm back 10 months later mm -hmm. for veneers. Uh, we had to do, to your canines, we had to be additive to help with the bite stuff. Mm -hmm. So you came back so we could make those more permanent with ceramic. We use CAD CAM, like robotic technology to replicate yeah. the exact shape. So then we bonded those. So now, those should last you hopefully a decade plus. Mm -hmm. Whereas if we just left the white bonding material on there, it probably would have failed in the next two to three years. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so it was yesterday that we did that. Yeah. Um, that was pretty easy, wasn't it? Yeah. The process. Oh, yeah. it wasn't bad at all. Yeah, and then today we checked you again yeah. just to make sure. How's it feeling? It feels great. It feels better than it did before. It feels better than we accomplished last time and it feels better today than it did yesterday so yeah, it treats it a little bit more it's the best bite that i've had uh since this entire fiasco began yeah. seven years ago so what, what set it off seven years ago i went to i i went to a dentist for a cleaning yeah. and while i was there she convinced me to get four fillings done and i said i'm here for a cleaning she mm -hmm. said well they're gonna have to be done eventually <laughs> And she did four fillings in one at one time, mm. and uh, the Novocaine wore off, and I was in excruciating pain. And uh, I tried everything I think you could possibly imagine. I just an endless amount of bite adjustments. Um, by her and others. By her and others. After a while, I wouldn't go back to her, yeah. uh, and uh, uh, other people did it. I mean, I must have had, I think, 15 or 16 bite adjustments yeah. to one point where somebody's bright idea was to just shave down in my 18 or 19, had a tooth extracted, mm -hmm. had two root canals, mm -hmm. believing that it was uh, that, was that, and uh, everything would x-ray okay, but they were just chasing down this phantom Bang. thing. Yeah, and never would go away. Had acupuncture, physical therapy, went to endodontists, and uh, I literally, it, it was ruining my life. And uh, one day I was, I was searching on the computer and I saw a video mm. and I on YouTube, watched the video and I seen that there was about 50 other videos on there. And I think I spent one entire afternoon, I must have watched 20 or 30 videos in a row. Where were they filmed? They were filmed right here. <laughs> they were all right here. And people had come from all over the United States, and some people had come from overseas. Yeah. And uh, every person's description, some of them were, were a little bit different, yeah. but most of them, I think there was one guy from South Carolina, yeah. and he had just described 10 or 11 things, and I said, that that's my problem. And I go, well, I'm gonna have to go see this guy, so. Yeah, so here you are a year later. Yeah. So all in all, maybe half better, huh? Uh, you tell me. Yep, yep. For sure. There. Oh yeah. yeah. But the thing is, though, it, it it doesn't sound impressive when you say it's half better. Yeah. But it's that half. That's the difference between. It's a very dark place. Mm -hmm. You know. It's it was awful. Yeah. I had just days where I'd be writhing in pain and. Well, we, I still there's still some soreness there, but it's just nothing <clears throat> compared to. Yeah, know. but you know what we did different in the screening itself is we helped you understand that your joints aren't normal. Like lots of us are torn up, right? But. Yeah. We know definitively that you have an orthopedic problem and that influences the bite. So we confirmed that the joints appear to be quite stable with the MRIs and the CTs. So then and only then do we go front uh, to the bottom here to the teeth themselves and we adjust basically the movements. Mm -hmm. We're using computers and we can study all this data and it's reproducible objective and there's all kinds of research behind it and yeah. we've been contributing to that over the years.
So when I came the first time, I had one tooth that was contacting when I shut yeah. my mouth. One tooth in my entire mouth. That was joint based or yeah. resultant of them hacking your teeth off, like you were saying earlier. Yeah. One one or the other, and it was just too much. The system was was angry. Yeah. So now, if you look at your data, things are very even. Yeah. You know, not just when you bite down, but the the range of motion, the the kinesiology of how the mandible is moving and function is is, is smooth and, and beautiful. And it feels totally different. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you very much. Um, thank you very much. I appreciate it. <laughs>